From the studios at the School of Communication and Journalism, welcome to Stony Brook Media Group's Halftime Report, brought to you by Tropical Smoothie Cafe. I'm Brittany Dietz. From Manhattan to Stony Brook, American Ballet Theater made its first ever full company debut at the Stoller Center for the Arts. A sold-out audience enjoyed three programs, including Alexei Retmansky's songs, A Bukafina, Clark Tippett's Some Assembly Required, and Jessica Lange's Zigzag to songs sung by Tony Bennett. The American Ballet Theater, also known as ABT, is led by newly appointed artistic director Susan Jaff, former principal dancer with the company for 22 years. One of the dancers was Long Island native ABT, principal dancer Corey Stearns. The Stoller Center was excited to welcome him home. This past Friday, Jubilee Latinos celebrated their second annual banquet. Alexis Savoric and Emmy Garcia went out to report on Jubilee's prom. As the night came to an end, we said farewell to the Jubilee seniors. Emmy Garcia reports. Hey, Seawolves, my name is Emmy, and we're out here in the SAC celebrating Jubilee Latino's second annual banquet. As you can see, we're having a ball out there. If you know, you know. If not, you missed out. It's a chance for me to show people what the Latin culture is about and like all the different, the different cultures, the different uh, types of, of people that we have. Um, because people think that when you say Latin people, it's only Mexico and there's like more different, like different countries. Our main thing is diversity. Like we're not just trying to like focus on Latinos. We're trying to focus on everybody as a community, not just like you know us, but every everybody else as a part of Stony Brook. Oh. Do you get nervous before performing? Not really. I don't get really nervous before performing. Joining a very high energy community like really helped me like be more comfortable here. Of course my favorite dance is salsa. I grew up watching my parents and my aunts and my whole family just dancing salsa. I loved how they moved and I always wanted to learn and perfect it. So I thought this was really a perfect um, opportunity to represent that at a campus. When, when I go to dance practice, I feel like a part of me um, is home. That's it from La Familia. We'll see you next year for Jubile Latino's third annual banquet. To continue highlighting female leaders in honor of Women's History Month, our MVP this week is Lauren Richmond. Richmond is an assistant professor in the College of Arts and Sciences Department of Psychology. She has been awarded the J. Don Reed Early Career Award, which recognizes the outstanding contributions of emerging scholars in the area of applied memory and cognition. Congratulations and thank you for all that you do. Before we go, we want to give a big shout out to the men's baseball team's head coach, Matt Sank, for getting 900 wins here at Stony Brook. That is an amazing accomplishment. Congratulations. That's it for us in the studio. We'll get you back out to Laval Stadium for first half stats and analysis after this.